Yes everyone, what's happening? We're back with another review and today we're going to be going into the Nike Hirachi Liverpool FC edition. So these released on the 1st of December to much dismay from Liverpool fans. None really liked it. We didn't see much support of any. Mark's behind the camera. You'll know Mark if you're on our TikTok. Mark, did you see anyone like them? I think one or two? In real life, yeah, but not online. Yeah, keep tuned because we are going to be showing you some real life uh, footage from Liverpool fans, their opinions on the shoe. But before that, let's have a look into it. So it's got a red and white print on the neoprene area, the sock liner. But what's interesting about it is it's like glossy. And this was made because of the cop. They say the cop has red and white flags. They do, to be fair, but not like this. Not like that. I, I think it's more inspired by back in the day, what it used to be like. It's not like that right now. It's more, we'll stick up a picture of modern flags there. Then on top of that, it's got the yellow strip down the middle, which I believe is inspired because of the away kit, which we have here. So we think that this yellow was done to match with the away kit. And to be fair, they said the away kit is inspired by the 80s, uh, a previous Liverpool kit design, which to be fair, there is an 80s kit design, which is very similar to this which we'll also put up here. As you can see, it is very similar. I just think the yellow stripe might have threw a lot of people off, which you will see from our interview with a Liverpool fan. Another added detail of the shoe is the Velcro straps on the heel and on the sock liner of the shoe. So the shoe comes with this bag attached, which has two spare patches for each shoe. These are the two patches that you can put on the tongue. So these two patches go on the tongue. And then these two patches go on the heel, the strap, which is obviously known for breaking with Hirachis, but we haven't seen this problem with the new pairs yet. They do seem to be a lot more solid compared to pairs that released around seven years ago in 2014. We haven't seen any of the new pair straps break yet, luckily so, happy days. Another interesting detail about the shoe is the box. This is probably the best box I've seen delivered to Bennett's since we started. I think that's fair to say, Mark. Uh, yeah. It comes with and the red and white print as the paper, like tissueing for the uh, interior. It's packaged incredibly. I really have no bad words to say about the packaging at all, which makes me think that these are really meant for collectors, which I completely understand. You've also got uh, the stripes here, which you've seen on classic Hirachi releases back in the day. On top of that, they have a Nike and Liverpool label stitched into the inner sole. I don't think I've ever seen this on a pair of shoes before. Mark, have you? I haven't seen that, no. It's usually just uh, like a design, isn't it? Yeah, sometimes yeah, it's just like, like a little sticker that'll come off with a couple of wears. This definitely isn't coming off, which, as I said, really adds to the detail of it being a, cla a class collector's shoe. So we can compare them with a similar pair right now. Mark is going to throw it to us, go on lad. What a catch. So as you can see, the leather on both shoes are very similar. This is just like a standard new Hirachi release. Mark actually got mixed up with these two. He's yeah. seen these in foot asylum and thought it was the actual Liverpool pair. The levers are both very similar. The build of the shoe is similar all up until the little details like the Velcro and uh, the stitched inner sole. And obviously uh, the neoprene is different here. It's got like a glossy material. If you're into Hirachis, these are a perfect summer shoe. I, I can't lie, I love Hirachis. They were one of the first shoes that ever got me into Nike in the first place. But I just don't think I'd wear these. I can't see myself wearing them. It's definitely not in winter, maybe in the summer. I think they've got a lot of unnecessary hate where people just jump on the bandwagon. In person, they're really not that bad. I've, I've got to be honest, in person, they're at least a six out of 10 wearability wise. I do think they're wearable. This is what Liverpool fans had to say about them before the Aston Villa game. What's happening? I'm with my man, what's your name? Luke. Luke, what's happening? Right, what do you think on these new athletes? At least give a day, what do you think? Yeah. Seen worse, like, but. Not the greatest car, I mean. <laughs> no, nah, but actually, I haven't had a pair of Hirachis in years, like, but they're better than the, uh, the new Hirachis, because these are like the old ones, aren't they? Yeah, the shape of them, yeah. But not the best colourway, is it? That bit's not, if that was black, maybe, but seem better, seem worse, really. Just, yeah. just mediocre shoes, really. What's happening? I'm here with Hassan, Hassan my brother, right? So, he's just released two months ago, what's that? You're alright, not bad. 
nice colour, uh, got a nice effect to them. Uh, I like this, yeah, yeah, the, uh, what they did, third kit, yeah, yeah, third kit as well. Yeah, they're nice, they're alright, not bad. They are the worst webs I've ever seen. What don't you like about them? Nah, it's something like a bacon would wear. <laughs> if one Liverpool player passed or present, like, was it to wear these, who definitely wear that? That's what JBLC say or something, wouldn't it? It'd have to be, lad. Yeah, probably, yeah. yeah. If you were a Liverpool player, what player definitely would be? If I was a Liverpool player. Nah, nah, if the shoes were, <laughs> nah, if the shoes were. Uh, I'd say Trent. Trent, yeah. yeah I see Trent in these. Hi, very yeah, nice one, lad. Thank you, Hassan. No, Thank you, very appreciate that top one. And Jadekin, if there was any shoe like Nike should make in the future for a Liverpool shoe, yeah, that's what pair, Jadekin? It's got to be a pair of one tens, hasn't it? 100%. It's got to be one. I don't want to play in that. Nice one, brother. Thank you, lad. Appreciate that, lad. Thank you, 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 you can get the best deal online on these on our website. We've linked it below. I can't see these selling out anytime soon. So hopefully if you catch this video at the right time, you should definitely be able to purchase them. If they are sold out though, keep an eye on restocks on the link. Make sure you subscribe and click the bell notification because I promise when we do upload, we put in a lot of effort for them and it should be a banger. If you want to catch all the new releases, make sure you follow us on Instagram, Twitter and TikTok, Bennett underscore. Thank you for watching and we'll catch you on the next one.